Yeah, unless you are from uh, Arizona. Yeah. Or the United States. Of well, then you've probably played with Frank, who is uh, considered like the best solo Luigi made in the world. And yeah, like I said, the uh, the top seed here in Division Three. See what Henny is able to do about what this grab. I, I swear, fucking was completely behind Luigi when he got that grab. Oh, the fast fall. Yes. Up to extend it, but then doesn't extend it as long as he could have to an extra up there. An odd amount of extension on that one. Medium extension. Yeah, he did the double jump, but then once you've done the double jump, it's really easy to do a fast fall up air, so he was able to land that with no worries. Just finish the combo off that way. I really love that spot where Luigi was down tilting and Falcon was grabbing and both of them were missing. Ooh, I think the reason he chose to extend the combo on the first stock was he just wasn't sure he was in position to get the up beat. So he got like fast fall up air. Freya trying to down beat a hit stun and he's not in the right spot to get hit by it. Of course the down B is a really good get off me tool for somebody who doesn't know that uh, Luigi's hit stun very well. Yeah. Uh, but it's super punishable if you don't hit it. And sometimes even if you do hit it. Oh, and he's trying to drop down on free, but he's ready for it. It's impossible to not try to grab Luigi there. Yeah. Just get down and tilt it. And yeah, Afrain is so aware of that. He's seen that dash grab a million times. Yeah. He knows exactly how to step it out. And when Luigi down tilts you, it's so hard to get away from the follow up grab that comes after. Unless you're at that person. And then you can just hit him like, before he's even allowed to move. Look at that up air landing out of hit stun. Freehan caught a piece of Henny's shield there. Got some pressure going. If you don't know how to fight Luigi, it's just so unintuitive and weird. Yeah, it's a very different game. Especially if you're like a Falcon who's used to just, you know, getting yeah. punishes off without needing to be like super precise. Exactly, and in, in this matchup you're not looking for up air to be. Luigi's too floaty. Yeah, and if you are doing those like up air up it has to be done in a really specific way with tight timing. Right. And, like long delay between the levels. Free and just showing his experience in a matchup like this, showing why he's the top seed here in D3. You kind of have to play this matchup like it's tough. You want, you, want to, you want to fish with your big aerials, your back air, your up air. Yeah. And then try to connect them into grabs. And you can get percents off grabs, but it's usually you're not going to be in a spot where you're going to get up air up at all. It's like fighting Puff, but if Puff could like rest out of his thing. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Yeah, like that stuff too, the frame two up air. Maybe in the true the oh, what? How did he he down smashed under Falcon's grab? <laughs> that smashes through the fireball. Free and take the first stop there. I think he might have done a taunt cancel, I'm not sure. Great DI to avoid the spike there. Pivot up air does work here. It's an edge guard situation. Yeah. Can you edge guard Luigi? He's throwing those fireballs. Those fireballs are so hard yeah. to deal with. Yeah. The reason those fireballs are there is to stop you from dropping from ledge and refreshing your invincibility. He throws them preemptively, and they just get there at the perfect time to mess you up and free him. Looking for a four stop here in game two. Oh my gosh, Playing don't don't grab like again. He keeps going for these uh, fireball bounces off the stage, yeah. too. It's just that like, weird little delayed timing I of the fireball. I think it's so unnecessary. <laughs> if you like it, then you know, do your thing. I think down until here against Luigi is good. Trying to get that landing up here after the fireball. Ooh, Freen accidentally pivots off stage, but he's looking fine. Back air from Henny. He's not really going to do it. Yeah, just like Pikachu, you just have to not contest his options that are in his range. You know, there's no need to run up to him and try to grab him. Very sad, tragic finish there. Yeah. Free and a dominant showing against Henny. Henny had a few spots like that. Demonstrating the natural knowledge.